<clears throat> Hi guys, welcome to OMG with the Jig. Um, today I'm going to teach you how to make um, an origami box like this. And it's pretty easy, I think. Um, there's only like one step at the end that's pretty tricky, so yeah. A little bit. Okay, so, and you have those little flaps inside stuff. So yeah, pretty basic box like that. You can make one like smaller or bigger put it like inside the, like the top course so yeah so get your origami piece of paper or your printed paper that you turn into a um, square and first start by taking your paper and folding it in half diagonally into a triangle so like and unfold and make sure that that crease is um, vertically and fold it in half this way Unfold. Okay, so make your paper like a diamond shape instead of like a square shape. Well, actually, it doesn't really matter, but okay, so it's using me. Um, take all your four flaps, take all your edges, and fold them to the center. You can fold them all in first, or you can do them separately like this. Okay, so now what we're going to do is turn this diagonally. So we have this, this top one right here. Um, you see where all these, you see where all these creases intersect here and it makes a cross at the top, those right there. We're going to take the bottom and fold it up to, to uh, lining it up with the center and stopping at that line right there. So it looks like that. So we're stopping right there, okay? And, and then when you do that, what you want to do is make this easier. Take this and fold it to that edge that we created from doing that. So fold that like that. Okay. And then do the same with the, with the other side. So make sure that you don't get confused when you're doing this side. So, like, pretend it's not there. And we're going to, again, do where these creases intersect. So... Hold it right there. You can kind of tell if it doesn't have that little triangle or um, this little strip. So when you do that, again, fold that back to that little crease, lining it up also with the center, with this center, and also like that. So intersecting. And do the same with the other sides, of course. So you're doing it four times. And we're going to basically create a series of squares. Okay, so now that we're done with that, what we're going to do is, it doesn't matter which two, um, take two flaps and fold them to the center, and they're actually already creased for you. And then, the good thing about this is what we did earlier, is we also made guide creases. So, if we just take this and we fold it there, and take this and we fold it there. It might overlap a little, and that's okay. Um, and then just crease a little bit, good. And then, basically, if you kind of lift those up that flap, put that up down you basically kind of got your two edges now just we, now we need to make these edges now so um what we're going to basically do is make a crease right here okay so this is what you can do if it's easier so take this and we're gonna we have like these like we have half a square one square two square three square four square half a square so what we're going to do is take this and fold it all the way to this first crease that you see here. So we're going to take it and fold it to the very first crease. So we're going to take it and fold it right there. So we're taking this and folding it to the very first crease, okay? And we're also, when we're doing this, like, if you're doing it like this, Sorry. So what you're doing is you're folding it, like if you did that, we're doing it until, if we're doing it until we don't see any white like that. 
the front. And then you have that little crease for your edge. Like, oh, sorry. Okay, so just like that for your edge. Okay, do the same for the other side. So take this and fold this. Take this and fold this to the first edge. Okay. So fold it out to the first edge. So we're taking a folding out to the first edge. Okay. I mean to the first crease, excuse me. And then when we get those two, they kind of should be touching and straighten out. You want to straighten out the corners really good too. And like should be like that. And take this and fold that all the way in. And sure, you have that crease there, but you can make it better if you want. And do the same on the other side. So again, um, we're taking this and just folding it to that first crease. And I just look at my white and I just see that. So I just go like, I just go like, oh, fold it all the way until I don't see any more of that white. And then just do that and like that. Same thing though. And then do that and then put that in. And then there you go. Straighten out your corners by creasing them and maybe insides. Okay, so yeah, so that's how you make your box, and there you go. You've got your origami box. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.